Every single clothing brand that makes over $1 million in sales has done these four very specific things. And these four very specific things are things that most clothing brands are incapable of doing, haven't achieved yet, and just are not aware of. So what I want to share with you in this video are the four things that you need to do are absolutely necessary for you to have as a part of your clothing brand, as a part of your strategy and what you're doing in order to have a brand that crosses the $1 million in sales mark. How do I know this? Well, I've done over a million dollars in sales for my own brand. I've talked personally with dozens of clothing brands that are doing over a million dollars in sales and I've worked with thousands of other brands over the past eight years. I know this space very well and it's basically like in the clothing brand space, I can see into the matrix of it all and I just understand it on a fundamental level. So if you're starting up your own brand right now and you want to one day have a million dollar clothing brand that's doing over a million dollars in sales, please take this seriously, take notes of this because it's just absolutely necessary, you can't avoid it and you can't skip over it. The first thing is that your brand needs to have a unique selling point. It has to have something about it that is unique and that offers a competitive advantage that makes it difficult for other people to do it or achieve what you have done. This is an essential component to your brand and every single clothing brand that's doing over a million dollars in sales has a unique selling proposition. They have something about their brand that is giving them the competitive advantage. And there are many different ways that you can go about having a unique selling point or a competitive advantage. A couple examples of this would be Tentree, the clothing brand that every single time you buy one of their products, they'll plant 10 trees. So people aren't just buying their clothing to wear it on their bodies. Every single time that they buy their clothing, they're being incentivized by an actual environmental movement as well. And they're making a real impact on the environment. That type of unique selling point gives their brand a unique brand concept, a unique something about their brand that makes them stand out from every other brand that exists in the world. Another great example is Spanx. Spanx was started by Sarah Blakely. She's been one of the sharks on Shark Tank and she invented Spanx because she found that shapewear for women wasn't very flattering. And so she invented one that was actually flattering, that actually showed the curves of a woman's body. And because it was the best on the market, because she had a real competitive advantage and she was doing something that nobody else had done before, it's a billion dollar brand. The alternative to this is creating a brand that's just a regular lifestyle brand that a thousand other brands have come up with the same idea with just different names. There's nothing special about your brand. You don't have any sort of competitive advantage in your marketing strategies, in the influencers that you've collaborated with, in your designs that you're coming out with, in the way that you're marketing it. It's just basically like every other lifestyle brand. You're never going to be able to get the traction that you're looking for. So this is like the biggest lesson and it's from ground zero right when you start up your brand if you can't answer the question right now what makes my brand truly unique what makes it stand out and what gives it that competitive advantage stop everything that you're doing go back to the drawing board and figure that out because you're just never ever going to grow if you don't know what's making your clothing brand stand out now before i share with you the next three things you need to have for your brand in order to make over a million dollars I need to let you know that Apparel Success is sponsored by my buds over design crowd. And if you struggle with designs, I seriously recommend that you check them out. Whatever crazy design idea you have in your brain, you post it to design crowd. Amazing designers from all over the world are going to compete for your project. You choose the winner, then you get that design plus revisions. I've sold thousands of these designs on my website and I got them all made through design crowd. If you're interested, head over to designcrowd.com forward slash apparel to learn about the special offer that I have for you, or just use the discount code apparel when you post a project on design crowd. The second component that you absolutely need in order to get to over a million dollars in sales is you need quality and consistency. And I know that that sounds really generic, but I need to explain this on a deeper level. Quality and consistency in the sense that all of your products are made high quality. All of them are made consistently and every single customer that you get along your journey, you're treating very well. This will allow you to develop something known as brand loyalty and it will lead to repeat customers, which are the lifeblood of your clothing brand. In order for you to move any significant volume with your brand over time, you have to have people who have bought your brand that are happy customers who come back and buy again and again every time you release a new drop. Having to acquire new customers all the time for your brand over and over again will cost you so much more money and will be so much more difficult 
trying to expand your audience constantly rather than just selling to your repeat customers through your email list with retargeting ads, with people just naturally coming back to your website and wanting to buy your clothing and check you out whenever they're looking and thinking they need a new hoodie or a new t-shirt or something. So as you're operating your brand, having this longer time horizon that you're viewing everything on, couple years to build some traction, to actually be consistent and put out that quality over and over again, and really build those repeat customers and have that brand loyalty is what's going to eventually build your brand into that million dollar company. The third key thing that your clothing brand needs in order to become a $1 million company is it needs to have a phase of just purely brand building. This is a phase where you're just straight up doing everything that you can to inject as much value into your brand as possible. What do I mean by this? Social media, building up your audiences, putting out free value, building up some sort of brand awareness and just building up that audience so that you can gain social proof so that you can have people that are following you and have an engaged audience who knows, likes and trusts you having collaborations and working with influencers. You're attaining these pictures of people who are wearing your brand that your target audience looks up to and already knows. And these, this can be this phase of just digging in, grinding it out to achieve these things. Every single clothing brand that's become over a million dollars in sales has gone through this phase of just straight up earning all of the value that their clothing brand has. And you can leverage your own network in this phase. You can do everything that you possibly can to just build more social value, build more value in general and credibility into your brand through just aligning it over and over again with your target audience to get it better and better and better and better, improving the products over and over again, collaborating with different influencers, reaching out, sending free clothing out to them and just hustling your ass off to just build your brand and build the value into your brand so that you have that competitive advantage. And the fourth essential component your clothing brand needs to have in order to get to over a million dollars in sales is you need to have scalable operations. And this breaks down into three main areas I want you to think about for your brand. The first one is fulfillment. As you're growing your brand, you're gonna have more and more orders going out. So you need to be able to scale that well, be able to handle all of those orders so that you can get them out on time. And that also includes your inventory. The second one is your marketing. You need to be able to scale up your marketing efforts and have it so that you're generating enough sales all the time, whether that's your email marketing, social media posts, advertising. And then the third one is you need to scale up your customer support. As you get more orders for your brand, there's gonna be people emailing you for refunds and it's just gonna get more and more and more as you build up your brand. And so having those scalable operations and understanding how you can do that already, having it ready to go in your head will allow you to smoothly transition into all those different phases as you start to build your brand. These are the subtleties that clothing brands that are doing well over a million dollars in sales are aware of and what they're focused on and how they think about it. They're thinking about it much differently than the average clothing brand that's starting up because the average clothing brand that's starting up is literally just winging it. They post once a month. They just have like designs that they don't even really know who they're for and it's some random brand concept. And it's literally all just about focusing in on all these areas and having the understanding at a deep level that if you don't have these areas taken care of, then what's the point? Because you're really never gonna get the results that you're looking for anyways. So I really hope that that helps get you reoriented and eventually helps you make a $1 million clothing brand. If you're thinking about starting up your own brand or you're already running one, you've gotta check out the Apparel Success Mastermind. It's a monthly subscription where you get direct access to me, access to a community of other clothing brand owners, all of my courses, and we do exclusive live streams every single month. You can learn more at apparelsuccessmastermind.com, and I'll see you in the next one. Peace.